definitely a lot different, you know, than other road games, even uh, going to Little Rock. You know, Jerry Jones is a former Razorback, so uh, he definitely loves the Hogs, and we can feel it. Well, the first time Jeff approached us about playing an annual game there, I mean, we could hardly get over our excitement to be able to not only uh, have our team, uh, the Dallas Cowboys, playing at AT&T Stadium and all the excitement that goes with that, but then to be able to bring your alma mater back is huge. Dallas, from an equipment manager standpoint, it's, it's amazing. The locker room is it's bigger than our basically our current home locker room. So as far as space goes, there's two coaches' locker rooms. Coach B's got his own, own locker room. There's a one half for the offense, one half for the defense. Most college football stadiums, they're not taking care of the visitor too much. Um, they want to make it as uncomfortable as possible. You get in there, your cramped quarters, tight living, you're, you're thrown off rhythm a little bit. But uh, we're spoiled in the sense that you, you show up to Jerry's world and you get first class treatment from the second you hit the ground. Just staying in a hotel, you know, it's a nice hotel that we stay in. The locker room is A1, you know, it's as good as it gets. So uh, just being in that locker room and, you know, just the, the whole trip in general just makes us feel real comfortable and at home. Road trips can start anywhere from a year and a half to two years out when you start looking at the hotel. But getting a little more narrow as you get closer to the game, you know, on this end, we're, we're going through the, the seating charts, uh, making sure the catering's set for the plane all those little details. Um, and then once we hit ground, we kind of meet up and then Pete and I handle it from there. We go out a day early before the team gets there on Friday to get the hotel set up, to get the stadium set up. We'll meet with the hotel Friday morning. We'll go over all the hotel logistics and we check all the player rooms and coaches rooms to make sure that the clock is right, the temperature is okay. So when the team arrives, everything is smooth for them so they can focus on the game. It's a very fine process to get everything packed because it's a lot. You know, a 48 foot trailer sounds like it's a huge trailer, but we use 47 and 3 quarters feet. So, I mean, it's, there's not much there. We're basically holding everything in and shutting the doors real quick to make sure, make sure we got everything in there. Allen, fourth and one here as they're making sure Brandon Allen took a pretty good lick there and trying to dig out the field turf in the helmet. You know, on the field, we do a lot of a lot of extra things as far as we have backup helmets. So if something breaks, we have one helmet of each size um, for some of our guys. You know, Brandon Allen, Alex Collins, guys that are they're in every play, our entire offensive line, guys that we can't afford to miss any time. We have a second helmet. It's trying to be prepared and think of any situation we can. Dallas is a little bit unique. Um, you know, you're playing in a pro stadium. You've got the jumbotron, so we like to go in. To the stadium, we would like to, to create a general buzz for the players. We want them to be excited about playing there. So we'll go in, we'll let them take the pictures, get all that out of the way, take pictures with their friends, take pictures of the big board. We want them to get all those those little things out of the way so when we come in on game day, there's no, that shock and awe is gone. Allen gives it to College. College spins away in the backfield at the five. Touchdown, Arkansas! Being able to add this game in is definitely a huge event for us as far as recruiting. Um, you know, this is something that, you know, I, I definitely enjoy being from the Dallas area, being able to go home and, and play in front of my family and friends that are close. So, uh, you know, just adding this game and being able to get back to Dallas uh, every year is definitely huge for recruiting. Be able to bring uh, the Arkansas Razorbacks and, and play an annual game at the Southwest Classic is huge. And uh, I think it really helps us in terms of uh, touching young people in the state of Texas. Uh, hopefully uh, Arkansas playing this game will help uh, uh, pull a few of those great athletes out of Texas up here to Fayetteville. I know they'll certainly look back on it and be glad they made that decision.